हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू दिसवन इंजीनियरिंग यूट्यूब चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब और चैनल फॉर डेली सेवन इंजीनियरिंग वीडियोस टुडे योर लेक्चर इज अबाउट द स्टेयर केस डिजाइन सो इन दिस लेक्चर आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्रेस द डिफरेंट टर्मिनोलॉजीज यूज्ड इन द स्टेयर केस लेट्स कंसीडर दिस इज द एन एग्जांपल ऑफ द स्टेयर केस यू कैन सी हियर दिस इज द साइड व्यू ऑफ द स्टेयर केस और वी कैन सी द एलिवेटेड व्यू ऑफ द स्टेयर केस व्हाइल दिस इज द प्लान ऑफ द स्टेयर केस in which you can see the width of the staircase this is known as the width of the staircase which is 5 feet usually used in the normal houses while this staircase composed of certain terms i will discuss one by one and also will show how to find the different terms how to calculate the different terms used in the staircase these are known as the landings in the staircases which are connected usually to the slab either to the top of the slab either to the bottom of the slab these terms are known as the landing they connect the staircases with the slabs either to the top of this bottom of the slab of your building or the top of the slab of the building so these two are known as the landing and each staircase has landing now this is known as is the riser the vertical distance you can see here of each step this is known as the riser which is given here is 6 inches so i can write it here that our riser in this case is equal to the 6 inches or i can convert into the foot 0.5 foot the horizontal on which you put your feet while moving this this is known as the tread so i can it, it is given here it is that it is 12 inches so i can write it here the our tread here in this case is 12 inches are 1 feet and generally the range is between the 8 to 12 inches while the riser range is 4 to 6 inches and this is known as the horizontal distance of the uh, or the total horizontal distance covering the staircases so i will also find out the horizontal distance how to calculate the horizontal distance and this is the length of the staircase i will also calculate the length of the staircase how we find out the length of the staircase by giving some by, by by some known dimension and this is known as the height of the staircase represented by h so first to calculate the number of steps used in this staircase for example we are known that the height of the staircase is 10 foot the height of the staircase is known as 10 foot and we want to find the number of steps how many number of steps are used or uh, uh, should be used while Uh, having the dimension of 6 inches of riser and 12 inches of tread so the number of steps can be found out by dividing the height of the staircase total height of the staircase and the the each staircase height you can see the riser so the total height of the staircase you can see here is 10 foot while the each riser height is 0.5 foot it should be in the same units so we divided by so we get the total number of steps is equal to the 24 so the number of steps are 20 so total number of steps are if i consider is 1 2 3 4 4 so if we have the height of 10 foot and the riser of 6 inches so we have 20 number of steps to be used in this staircase now how to calculate the number of thread there is simple formula it how we calculate the number of thread we can calculate it is by this formula with number of steps minus 1 the number of steps are known to us which which are 20 minus 1 we get 19 so 19 number of threads are used this one this is 2 3 4 9 and 19 number of threads are used while the number of steps or you can see you can see the number of risers are 20 a riser should always be greater by one amount than the number of thread now how we found out the horizontal distance this horizontal distance that can be found out by this formula that the number of steps by multiplying it with the thread so the number of steps are 20 and you can see the thread uh, the thread distance is like this one which is 12 inches if i convert into foot so it comes out to be 1 foot so it comes out to be 20 foot So the total horizontal distance is 20 foot. 
having a thread of 12 inches. So I found out the unknown dimensions of the staircase. Now the other thing we remain is the length of the staircase, the total length of the staircase which is unknown to us. So the length can be found out is we know that the horizontal is known to us, horizontal distance and the vertical distance is also known to us. So you can use the Pythagoras theorem by the 10 square the vertical distance and with the horizontal distance which is 20 square. So I can get to know. So by calculating this value I get 22.36 feet. So the total, the total length of the staircase comes out to be 22.36 feet. So this was all about the staircase, how to find the different unknown terms in the staircase. Hope you guys understand how to find the number of steps, the number of threads, the horizontal distance while in the staircase and the total length of the staircase. Hope you guys understand and don't forget to subscribe my channel for DD7 engineering videos. Thank you for watching my video.